Hi and welcome to this video. Today we are going to take a look at our familiar CF push experience on a Tanzu application service deployed for Kubernetes and take a look at how the backend components operate on a Kubernetes cluster to make all of this work. So let's start. Now I already have a Tanzu application service for Kubernetes deployed on a Tanzu Kubernetes grid integrated cluster. Uh, so let's take a look at that cluster. So you'll see the Tanzu application service components already pre-deployed. For example, the uh, the CAPI API, the log cache for collecting logs and Fluentd, as well as um, you'll also see Istio deployed along with KPAC and a build system. Now there are two methods for deploying applications to Tanzu application service for Kubernetes. One is we can do uh, the familiar CF push on an executable code, um, and then the CF service in the back end will start building that, and it will create a container image for us and deploy it onto the Kubernetes cluster. Or the second option, which is if you already have a containerized workload that you want to run, you can simply point to that container image in a repository and do a CF push of that container image. And Tanzu application service will help create the workload for that. So let's take a look at both of these uh, examples. I already downloaded uh, a sample application and I'm going to do a CF push of that app. It's from the Cloud Foundry sample apps repo. So let's see what happens. Now in the back end, the build service is going to take the bits for this application and convert it into a container and upload it into the registry that we specified when we created uh, or deployed Tanzu application service. Once it has uploaded the container image, it's going to start running that container with the workload within Kubernetes. At the same time, it will also be creating some sidecar proxies along with the container so that we can do effective routing. So the application has deployed. Um, let's take a look at it. You'll see it's CF demo. And let's take a look at the routes that were created for it. So you'll see, you know, the automatic route name and the domain name for Tanzu application service. Now let's check my Docker repo to see what happened there. So I'm gonna refresh. You'll see that the container image that we just created was uploaded to Docker Hub uh, a couple of minutes ago as part of the build service. Now, if we look at Kubernetes itself, we'll see that uh, under the CF workloads namespace, we have the CM demo test app running as a container and also that the CF workload staging area has the build process created and completed to uh, build this image. So this was the first method through which we do a CF push on a, a executable code. We can also push applications that have already been containerized. Let's take a look at that next. So I'm going to use a CF push to execute a container already uploaded onto Cloud Foundry's repo. Uh, in this case, our build service doesn't have to build a container for us. It's just going to fetch it from the Docker Hub Cloud Foundry repo and deploy that along with uh, the other Cloud Foundry components needed to route and um, uh, create logs for it. Right, so the test app has been deployed. Let's take a look at that. You'll see the test app along with the previously deployed app uh, created. Now, if you look at the Kubernetes containers, we'll see one more added in the CF workloads namespace. So you'll see now there are two containers. One was the previous one that we created and uh, the test app. At the same time, there were two jobs executed in the CF workload staging area. Now, if you look at the uh, details of this particular container, we 
you'll see that there are two containers staged within this pod. So this particular pod has two containers. Um, one is the Istio init container and then our actual uh, container that was uploaded to my Docker repo. And that's the workload container. The sidecar pro Istio container is going to help us create ingress routes uh, for this particular workload. So that's it. Um, there you have it. Two workloads deployed through CF push into Tanzu application service for Kubernetes. Thank you for watching this video.